suggestion, and that is this, that before we decide either to save the planet or to destroy it, we pause for a moment of silence. I don't mean that kind of grim silence which one observes when somebody says, uh, such and such a famous person has just died and we'll observe a moment of silence in his honor and everybody frowns and thinks very serious thoughts. That's not silence at all. I mean real silence. In which we stop thinking. In which we stop. And experience reality as reality is. Because after all, if I talk all the time, I can't hear what anyone else has to say. And if I think all the time, and by that I mean specifically talking to yourself subvocally inside your skull. If I think all the time, I have nothing to think about except thoughts. And so I'm never in touch with the real world. Now what is the real world? Some people have the theory that the real world is material or physical. I say it's made a kind of a stuff. Other people have the theory that the real world is spiritual or mental. But I want you to point out that both those theories of the world are concepts of words.
Old times are changing. They ain't no respect to the old school. Oh, bollocks. There's no school like the old school, and I'm the fucking head master.
hard to believe.
thing my father believed more than anything else was the development of the country of the mind. He believed that the mind was a country and you had to develop it. You, have to, you had to build and build and build and build the mind. That was his, his whole philosophy, is the development of the mind. My mother believed in the development of the heart. And I believed in the development of the hands. DJs, the people in the DJs. We're the DJs, the people in the DJs. But I just get in the perfect rhythm and I play, I don't care. And the people are allowed to do as they wish. If it's a really good show, there's like a thousand, ten thousand, fifty thousand people, fifty thousand minds, fifty thousand subconsciousnesses that I can dip into.
you are now in an orchard lounge. You are now in an orchard lounge.
sorry. But I don't want to be a, an emperor. That's not my business. I don't want to rule or conquer anyone. I should like to help everyone if possible. Jew, Gentile, black man, white. We all want to help one another. Human beings are like that. We want to live by each other's happiness, not by each other's misery. We don't want to hate and despise one another. In this world, there's room for everyone, and the good earth is rich and can provide for everyone. The way of life can be free and beautiful, but we have lost the way. Millions of despairing men, women, and little children, victims of a system that makes men torture and imprison innocent people. To those who can hear me, I say, do not despair. The misery that is now upon us is but the passing of greed, the bitterness of men who fear the way of human progress. The hate of men will pass and dictators die. And the power they took from the people will return to the people. And so long as men die, liberty will never perish.
姐妹。